Car Jerry, how's it going? How you doing, buddy? Sorry, I got a sliced finger, so I got to be oh, careful. Shit. That's okay. I got it with I, I nerfed it with a grinder. Like I took it all the way to the fingernail, from the yeah, from the knuckle to the fingernail all the way through. Yeah, I got the grinder got me good. So, hey, Paul, how's it going? Willie brought the vet tonight, huh? Look at that. We got Pino Bob in the house. Ralph Palomares, Junior, that is. We got Mouse and Mary. Look at that. Thirty-six. So, yeah, and today I'm enjoying my first day of unemployment in four years. Did you get laid off? Yeah, I got let go. So. And it was, uh, I didn't get laid off. Did you have my choice? It was a mutual parting of the ways. That's way behind the And there's Ralph. <laughs> hey, what's up, Max? How you doing? Hey, Ralph, how you doing, buddy? All right, Patrick. Hello, hello, like your flag, looking good. Yeah, that's nice my big brother, Patrick Comfort. How you doing, sir? That's my I, big... like, I like the old logo better than the wheel logo. Yeah. You okay. know? That's my big brother, Ralph. everything. That's a broad. What time are you? Uh... I'm sorry? That's my big brother, Ralph. Really? He's the one with the big cock. Oh. <laughs> I heard that rooster before. Yeah, 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 yeah. definitely. That's cool. Well, I'm glad you brought him, you Green know? Track? Car? No, I didn't. It's dirty, and I I, I got a split. Long day. I, yeah. It's been a long day. That's all I got to hey, say. Bobby Z in the house. Bobby Z getting shot with the sun to his back, and David Lassard. Hey, how you doing? Hey, with short hair, and what a great story. Um, <laughs> Thank you for helping out, people. That's really great. That's well, awesome of you. He came down Route 66 all the way from where? Illinois. Illinois. Wow. We did so that fun. in 1976. We drove from here to Chicago. Yeah. On Route 66. That's crazy drive, isn't it? Yeah, oh, yeah, and I drove a lot of it when I was 16. It was well, my fun. My father did it too in a borough. That's great. We did it in a Winnebago <laughs> Chieftain. I did, I did it in a 1983 Toyota Dolphin Motorhome. Wow. Oh, in a Dolphin Motorhome? Yeah. Remember when they were shipping those to Japan like crazy? Everybody yeah. wanted them? Walking down the row here, we got Mouse, we got Willie. Speaking of Willie, there's Chili Willie. How are you, sir? You're the man. But I've been seeing Patrick Comfort. Oh, thanks. Bobby Z. Bobby Chili Z. Willie in the house. Chili Willie in the house, baby. Nice. Good to see you. Good to see you. Good to see you. <laughs> All right, man. We've got Pino Bob in the house. Good look under the hood here. Yes, it does. Don't get much of a look under the hood on this, so there it is. Yes, it does. Okay. Hello. All right. All right. We got. Hey, Patrick. Hey, hey, David again. And Ralph Jr. Yes, sir. 2022 Corvette. No Z06 is to be built. They can the Z06. Nope. And they're giving me no performance upgrade. No Z06. Nothing. Done. From here on out. That's it. They they killed it. They said no more. They're, uh, that's not the direction that Chevy says they're going to head in. They're going electric, so there's no need. Uh, this is more than enough. Right? This is more than that. That's how they announced it. This is as far as we need to go. It's just too bad. Okay, Tom's 58 pickup. Apache 3100. Beautiful truck here. He got car of the month last month. Take a look in there. There goes that rooster crew. Crockadoodle doing. And look at what we have right here. This looks like a 64 and a half. Could be a 65. You know, I'm thinking it's a 64 and a half. This is the one. Yes, it is. This is a 64 and a half GTO, guys. This wow. is the one. Wow, this is the wow. one that John DeLorean, John DeLorean himself, put this as an option package on the dealer sheet. So you could ride it in, and that's how he was able to sneak it past GM execs because they did not want this car built. So this is the one that they snuck through. So this is an original 64 and a half GTO. This is the, considered the godfather of muscle cars. I mean, yeah, and John Z, his very first real project and a big winner for GM. 
I, you know, I never knew whose truck this is right here. It's a nice, uh, I'd say, yeah, I think it's a 32, but I'm not sure. I, the grill, I always get thrown off by them. But this is the one that has that Fire Dome DeSoto 8 in it. So it's got a Hemi in it, which is kind of nice. And then we've got the Futuramic Olds right next to it, which is just super sick. This was here last week as well. Hey, Mouse and Mary. We got Mouse and Mary in the house. Love the seats in this thing. This thing just looks like it's comfortable to drive. Very fun. And we got Mouse and Mary here. I am super early. Super girl. Hola. Hola. Hi there. Hi, sweetie. How, How are, are you? you? Good to see you. What's up, my brother? I got a kind of bad, yeah. I could grind her nerf. <laughs> That'll do it. Oh, yeah, I found the grinder. Oh, that was a hand grinder. Was yeah. Ding! Oh! Yeah, then it went. I had to go into triage mode. That'll cut through like butter. Right? Oh, it did. <laughs> nice bug here. Oh, look at that. He's got spinners on it. Nice bug. Yeah, and a live sticker. Yeah, so we've got a really nice showing, nice patina on this bug here, all original paint. Um, looking good. Well, it might be a repaint. We got Wonder Woman in the house. Sandra Morris here, which is cool. And of course, Jerry's 37 here. Man, that green is just amazing every time you see it, isn't it? And that gray interior and everything. It's just a really beautiful car. So we got a bunch of guys over here. Look at this Super B, man. 70? Take Beautiful. 70 Hemi. Ram charger on this. Super B. This car here is all original, if I remember right. I talked to the owner a couple times. He's really cool. He's got the dog. It's really badass. Take a look inside. Very, very, very cool. All those stickers. I love that when I saw the birds and the bees the other day. That was great. They had the Roadrunner and the Super Bee emblem on a pendant, and it was called the birds and the bees. All right, so yeah, all the hooligans in the house. We got Al here. We hey, Steve Thomas here. What's up, my friend? We got Tammy. Tammy, hi. There's Don Dorsey. Hello, Don. Hi there. How you doing? Here's hey, coming up. Enough. Let's see what Brian's got to say. We have tickets tonight that we're making a donation to the Reese Fund. Rusty's here tonight in the parking lot someplace. I haven't seen him yet, but I know he's here. Rusty, come here for me, please. Rusty is a really close, good friend of mine who always made me feel really important at SEMA. He works for mothers, and if you look at his bands on his arm, I asked him one day, so, Rusty, what's this band for? And he said, that's for my son, Reese. Reese had leukemia and Reese passed away, and I wear this band in his honor. And when I heard that, it touched my heart. And I felt that we needed to do something for him. So tonight, we've raised money for Reese, his pajama fund at Brenner's Hospital, eighth floor. Rusty's mom, Mich wife, Michelle, makes pajamas for, that, for the hospital. And um, we've raised a significant amount to help them. Tonight, Dawn is donating tickets for the Long Beach Grand Prix. Woo! Yeah. Listen, the tickets have an $800 value. You can't buy those tickets. I've been going to the Grand Prix for years. There's parking inside the Grand Prix, not outside for $25 in some weird parking lot. You get to go inside, the pits, lunch, the whole nine yards. So please buy a separate raffle ticket tonight because that money is gonna go to Rusty's family, to Michelle and to those kids at Briner's Hospital on the eighth floor so they can make Padir tonight. Rusty, I love you, bro. Say something. Uh, <laughs> He's not he, Not sure what to say. Listen, we're happy to have him here. We drug our butts for giving him this check. We were gonna send him the check, but God had a different plan for us. He brought him here tonight to our parking lot and we're gonna show this guy what we're all about tonight and we wanna help. So thanks for coming. Thank you. I love you, bro. Thank we'll you. write you a little check in a little while. We're going to call you up front when the meeting comes. We have a little something we want to give you, and we're going to ring your bell tonight. There you go. Thanks for coming, bro. I love you. Thank you. Awesome.
mothers in the house. Good for you, man. That's great. Thanks. Congrats. Man. Sorry, got a got a got a bad wing there. Rusty, nice to meet you. I'm Patrick, by the way. Nice to meet you. Likewise. All right, we got cop car Bruce in the house here. I do. Uh, I run around the studio. You know so yeah, here's my. Oh, thank you. On the YouTube. Okay. Yeah. There you go. Good meeting you. I just go shoot real fast, get her done. All right, cop car Bruce is here. And we got Don and Marie. And they're the ones that are donating an amazing set of tickets to the Long Beach Grand Prix. That is just gonna be amazing. And you get to have sweet, hey, what's hey, Russell, what is up, my friend? Yeah, what a different I'm look just for hanging you. out waiting to get the uh, winning tickets for the Grand Prix. Grand Prix. Of course, of I've course, I've always course. wanted to go and I've never, I've never done that. I used to go and I haven't been in years Ooh. and I would love to go again, but I don't know if I have, I got 20 Not tickets Saturday. in my pocket waiting, waiting to be read. <laughs> That's nice. Question. Yes, sir. So you can show. All right. So here we go. Oh, Ray's in the house. Look at that. We've got Robert here, and Marvin brought the electric card. We got Justin doing the raffle. Hello, hello. Jack's in the house. Yo, yo, Jack. We got the Studelac here. Okay. Yo, what up, dude? What up, dude? <laughs> Mid uh, one o'clock in the morning, poker man. <laughs> Woo! Second place. That's right. But that was a negotiated deal <laughs> because we could have kept going. <laughs> and I was like, ah, uh, uh, uh. So look at that representing. Thank you, sir. Beautiful inside here. This is his grandfather's truck. It's got a 502 Caddy in it. Super bad. Got a El Camino G body bumper that's been narrowed and Frenched. Of course, we got Lee Van Drescha in the house. Steve Thomas's beautiful 1930. Love this five window. Max Kaminsky, 65 Corvair Monza. Then we come over here to Paul's beautiful 69 Chevrolet. Hey, gorgeous car. Look at all you guys. Hey, Bruce, how you doing? Good to see you, buddy. How you doing? I'm doing good. Doing good. How are you? Pretty good. I'm getting used to the clean shaven look. I'm finally starting to get used to it. Did you check out this uh, over here? Yes. All original. The guy. I talked to him at Garden Grove. A few weeks. Eleven. That's just nuts. nuts. Lee, how you doing, buddy? Good to see you. Wonderful. Wonderful. Trucks coming along wonderful. Oh, thank you. Yeah, I, if I hadn't nerfed myself with the grinder last night, I would be working on it right now. I got a full length. You know, you know exactly. You know what I'm talking about. <laughs> you know exactly. You know exactly. You're missing me. Oh yeah, I got some missing me. Hey guys, what's up? What up? Sorry, I'm doing. A, I'm having to do a. a Kind of a <laughs> modified, so, Jack, here, Jack, what's up, brother? modified fist bump here. So, oh, we got to go look at the flag here. That uh, that hair. We got the Olsen family in the house. What's up? Congrats, baby shower, huh? Yeah, dude, so cool, awesome. He's got a new license. Family cruise. So, if you ever look at the uh, sides of my truck, the emblems, you'll recognize them on my black truck. Yeah, next time you look at my, I don't have it here, but next time, it's those yeah. What are those from? Is that your cruiser over there? No, 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 that's not mine. No, I didn't have my car tonight. They're dirty and I just didn't have time to get them cleaned up, so. All right, and we got Dave Lassard here, and he brought his Harley, and he also brought a really nice little Dano and Fig uh, tribute flag. That looks like Saul, who I haven't seen in forever. How, are you, man? It's good How the heck you. are you, buddy? Oh man, it's been a while. How you been? Good, good. good How's good life treating you? you? That's good. Good, yep. good. It's good to see you, man. Love the new car right there. Yeah, I haven't. You know, I'm getting over to actually see it. Not one bit of bother. That's good. That's good. I like I like Virgin Metal. So let's go look at uh, Steve's new car. He no longer has the truck. There's Marvin. Hello. And let's take a look and see what we've got here. So my, that's my first look at the Skylark, 65. That's it. When you're newer. Hey, nice car, Steve. No. So Steve got himself a 65 Skylark. Nice, I like the wheel. Hey, there's my brother, Robert. Oh man, just doing some shooting here. I guess the kids love this car. So they must have voted it right in. Oh yeah, because the kids all voted it. 
Very cool. So this is the wow, very clean motor. Look at that nail head. Wow, hey. Yeah, it's a beautiful nail head. Wow. Okay. That that makes the car. Yeah, that's uh makes it definitely worth lifting the hood. Mm -hmm. Damn, that's gorgeous. Off the uh, nice motor. Spare parts. <laughs> yeah, so he's really not that far away with this car. Yeah. You know, this car's a this is really nice interior. Uh, no. 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 We're gonna full engine. Thank you. Yeah, yeah, we're gonna uh, probably pull here. off the tram yeah. and sell it. Wow, good deal, dude. Thank you, sir. Awesome, man. Got spinners on it with Cooper Cobras. Woo -woo. Where'd, you, where'd you pull this out of? Uh, uh, Black Canyon City, Arizona. That's right. This is Arizona. You got the uh, love the nail head. They always broke because they were stiff. Is that what happened? They're they're not. Yeah, you know? that's why I, that's why you always find them broken like that. I, I, I had to look high and low to find it. And it that's great. Well, Steve got car of the week, and this is a brand new car. No longer a C10 owner, but looking good. All right. Oh, and go. Tom. We got like a six five. We got a. Looks like a 66. Oh, it's the 78 Bandit car. We have a good crowd here tonight, man. This is crazy. Yeah, it's, it's crazy. Trisha's here. I didn't even know. I just saw Trisha, Trisha Bell's here. So yeah, nice rolling on a few cars here. That looks like my old car, 8-Ball, except it's got a convertible. <laughs> but mine was black, but it was called 8-Ball. And I had the same chrome headlights on it That's and everything. drove off the Costco. Nope, that's oh. the one. Nope, that's the one that uh, the Yakuza showed up in my shop because the guy gave it to me for a bunch of money that he owed me, and they're like, "This is our car." And I say the phone. Really? Oh, when the Yakuza shows up at your shop and says, "This is our car," and uh, do the honorable thing, I did the honorable thing. So I ate about eighteen grand, <laughs> but that's okay. I still got my pinky, yeah. <laughs> and I still got my life. But yeah, that's back in the day when the Yakuza was rolling around. That stuff. That's the kind of market I was involved in the 90s and the early 2000s. Yeah. Yeah, no. I would have gave him the car and said, under one condition. And then what? So he better find you and go get killing for me. Because he owes me 18 grand. That's what I told him. Yeah. Yeah. Call it even. Exactly. I said, if you ever find the guy, you know, beat him well for me. Send me a finger. Are they taking off? You guys out? Are you out? Well, it's still hopped out over here. Gotcha. So you gotta you gotta fill the you gotta fill the hole. Yeah. Okay, got it, got it, got it. Things gotta be correct here. Ten four. First car I ever owned was a sixty five in Paul. That's beautiful. So you know this one this is a sixty six or ten. Yeah, it's a sixty six. Yeah, this one's a sixty five, I'm pretty sure. And of course, a yeah. sixty five. Yeah. Beautiful wagon. Oh, <laughs> we got grandpa's wagon. Alright guys, now we're finished and we're gonna go to the meeting room.